Law enforcement officers are continuing to search for ways to further build their capacity to identify financial crimes. Members of the Royal Grenada Police Force, the Financial Intelligence Unit, Customs and Excise Department, Coast Guard, Drug Squad, Inland Revenue Department, and Criminal Investigation Department met at the Cuyaba Beach Resort to discuss asset recovery and case identification. Facilitator of the one-day workshop, Jake Collins, is the program officer for Grenada and the Eastern Caribbean at the Bureau of International Narcotics and Law Enforcement Affairs. He said case identification is the backbone of asset recovery. We know that asset recovery is only effective if cases are properly identified. And that is the purpose of this workshop, to help build the existing capacity of law enforcement to identify financial crime cases and refer them to the ARD and Financial Intelligence Unit for further investigation. The United States encourages Grenada to deepen its interagency cooperation in the identification, investigation, and ultimate persecution of financial and transnational organized crime. Commissioner of Police Edwin Martin said that over the years, positive strides have been made, but more can be with all hands on deck with collective strategies. I am convinced that our potential and successes in pursuing civil asset recovery can be quadrupled by harnessing the power of the state investigative mechanism. Here I speak specifically to stronger collaboration between Inland Revenue, Customs, FIU, and the RGPF. Colleagues, Grenada's overall approach exemplifies a willingness to position our nation as a leading jurisdiction in asset recovery. Our ambition is to investigate and bring to justice those who choose criminal financial crimes. And more importantly, however, it is to design and implement an infrastructure to take profit out of crime and time continuation of criminal enterprise.